Special Olympics Manhattan partnering up with K-State for an intramural program that brings athletes and Wildcat students together. KSNT's Glenn Kinley joins us live to explain why today is a long time coming. Glenn? Brooke, a special day it certainly is. The, the coronavirus pandemic shut down sports everywhere. Most of them, though, were able to return after just a few months. For Special Olympics Unified Sports, the wait was much longer than that. But today, finally, they're back. It was really hard to watch other people do other sports. It's like, when are we going to be able to do something? We need to do something. The Special Olympics community is in a unique spot when it comes to dealing with the pandemic. Nice one, Tiff. Our population is especially high risk for COVID because most of them do have some underlying health issues. Um, so we've taken the pandemic uh, more seriously than maybe anybody. The waiting and waiting was not easy. It was really hard. We did some virtual stuff online. We've been on Zoom through the entire pandemic, but it's just not quite the same. Oh, it felt like forever and a day. It's like, let's go, please, let's go. But after almost 18 months, the return to play is here for Unified Sports. And needless to say, they're excited to be back. Yeah, I feel oh. so excited. It's like, words can't describe how I feel. I just feel so ecstatic. For Special Olympians and K-State students, life wasn't the same without this weekly activity. They're just all so sweet. They're just um, the greatest friends to have. They um, just make you feel so welcomed and um, just part of the Special Olympics family. It feels like you don't even have a disability when you're hanging out with them and they teach. We're all equal. We're all one. The first week of Unified Volleyball was tonight right here at the K-State Rec. And I was actually lucky enough to be a Unified participant back before the pandemic. It's a lot of fun, I can tell you that much. So I'm just really happy to see that they're back out here doing what they love. Reporting live in Manhattan, covering local news that matters, Glenn Kinley, KSNT Sports. All right, thank you, Glenn. I love what she said there at the end. We're all equal. We are all one. What a powerful reminder there.